Peter Mburu yuko shambani akaendeleza shughuli zake za kilimo. Amejitosa mzima mzima katika kilimo biashara ambapo anapanda nyanya zenye utofauti sawia na mishiri ya Kichina, almaarufu Chinese French beans kwenye shamba lake eneo la Lanet County ya Nakuru. The issue of having um, the work experience it's quite challenging. So I decided why why stay idle and there's a piece of land and I can do something else that can benefit me financially and can make me grow at least even the society. Kijana huyu barubaru walihitimu katika somo la masuala ya kusimamia biashara katika chuo kikuu cha Jomo Kenyatta lakini licha ya kisomo chake kilichomchukua miaka minne chuoni amekumbatia na chokenzi japo alichukua hatua hii baada juhudi zake za kutafuta ajira kugonga mwamba hali iliyomfanya kujituma katika ulingo huu Right now securing a white collar job is quite challenging because you need a lot of a lot of a lot of uh, qualifications na sawia na vijana wengine kupata mtaji wa kuanzia biashara ilikuwa changamoto ila senti kidogo alizokuwa nazo pamoja na usaidizi wa babake Vincent Kariuki ukampa pa kuanzia like to encourage parents out there it is high time we started teaching for us when we went to school our goal for going to school was one to get a white collar job but i think that mentality we are supposed to change it from our children aida licha ya ufanisi wake mburu anasema panda shuka hazikosekani ikizingatiwa kwamba zao la mmea huu ambalo huwa tayari baada ya kila miezi miwili bado si maarufu sana kwenye soko la humu nchini chemicals involved they are quite expensive and uh, it's a little bit challenging because the market for tomatoes is so porous because you get uh, there are quite some some imports from foreign countries and as you com- as you can compare the production cost from here and their country it's it's way much different kwa sasa kijana huyo anajiza titi kuboresha kilimo chake zaidi kwa manufaa ya wateja wake ambao zaidi ni raia wa uchina nixon kisaka k24 mashinani